Welcome back to Free Code Camp's basic algorithm scripting section. We're in lesson nine, truncate a string. And it says, truncate a string if it is longer than the given maximum string length. Return the truncated string with a dot 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 ending. Note that inserting the three dots to the end will add to the string length. However, if the maximum string length num is less than or equal to three, then the addition of the three dots does not add to the string length in determining the truncated string. So that one's actually not too hard. We could actually just clear this out, have an empty function. The first thing we're gonna do is check if string dot length is greater than num. So it's saying if this is true, we wanna return String, we could use the slice method here, which will let us to extract part of the string we specify. So we would say zero. So we're starting from the beginning of the string and we're going up. So if we check here, it also says if it's less than or equal to three. So that's the second condition. So inside our first one, we could actually add and num is greater than three. So if it is, then we want to extract from zero and then in here we want the length that is passed in and we want a minus three because like it's saying here, inserting three dots will add to the string length. So as long as we do that, num minus three, then we should be good and we could concatenate that dot dot dot. So then we could also say else if string dot length is greater than num and num is less than or equal to three, then we want to do this, return string dot slice, and we're starting at zero again, and this time we can just put in num. Because if it is less than or equal to three, then we don't really have to worry about that ending, we just want to add this dot dot dot. So right now, if we pass in a tisket, a tasket, a green and yellow basket, and the maximum is 11, when it runs through here, that string is going to be in here, it's going to check if the length of that string is greater than 11, which it should be, and it'll also check if 11 is greater than 3, which it is. So it should return our string extracted from 0. 11 minus 3, which would be, uh, what, 8? So it should return up to 8 characters, and after that, a dot, dot, dot. So let's go ahead and run test. So we're still not passing something and it seems to not be passing. Let us see what we're doing wrong still. So we can introduce one more else and this will be return string, which is here on, on this one that we're not passing. We're passing in the exact length of that string that we're passing. So none of these are actually running. This would actually return just the string by itself without having to worry about these other conditions. So this one actually should work now. And as we see now it does, because all conditions are met. So I guess the important part of this to remember, like here we got a tisket and then dot dot dot. The one that we weren't passing, which was this one here, they're passing the exact same, the string and the number was the same length. So this never ran and then this never ran either because it would check the length to see if it was greater than num, which it wasn't because it was the same. So adding this third condition allowed us to just return that string. And that is it for truncate a string with free code camp, basic algorithm scripting section.